Hey guys, this is Eliza and welcome back to a new video. So today is another small business haul, but this one is a repeat offender. This one we have done before. We have another parcel. This time it's in a big one. Last time we only got one of the little CD um, photo mailers. This time we got a large letter. And I can't get that. There we go. This one is another one from Mum and Me Designs, which is where I got some journaling stickers last time. I am actually using them this month in my January spread. I used the baking kit that I unboxed in that one, or unpacked, showed you guys, whatever, in that last video. And I actually really enjoy the quality, love them, and also I really enjoy the uh, five star, like the star rating one really enjoy that i decided to get some more so firstly i got something i didn't get last time and that is a notebook so it's just a little to-do list and it's got a cup of pens down the bottom here they've used a stamp to stamp their logo on the back this is quite nice quality there she is like that one the notebook is a dl size and it cost me five dollars 25 australian firstly we have two kits which I'll show you guys in a second, as well as all the individual stickers. And this one actually has a sticker on it that says, thank you for the first time website order with us. Last time I purchased through Etsy, not realizing they had a website. But of course, this time I purchased through the website because people, as a small business owner myself, I know that sh they are going to make more money if I purchase through the website than if I'm to purchase through Etsy because of Etsy's ridiculous fees. But Etsy drives traffic. So especially when you're a smaller business and you're not driving your own traffic, Etsy does have its benefits, but the fees seem to be getting more and more excessive. So when you can shop on someone's website and support their website. So I got two packs. The first one is Sweet Dreams and the second one is a Moving Day. Now this one I am buying in anticipation of when I move, which won't be for a few months probably. Let's open it up and have a look. I loved the colors in both of these. And again, I did buy the deluxe pack. They're $20 each, which I thought they were. So firstly, you get this little bonus sticker sheet, which is just like three little stickers. And that is what that one looks like. I love that they incorporate different hair colors and different skin colors and stuff. It's the same image, just with different skin colors. And then there is also one of those stickers on the first one where she has red hair. Firstly, we have page one, which looks like this. We have all these stickers that Yep, that went well. So we have moving boxes, we have keys, painting, moving truck. I love the plant with the like the really colorful background. So then page two is just this little to-do list type thing. Like you can fill in the hearts as like a tick, um, but they're all colors that match. Then page three is this one that's got like the little headers and stuff as well as this kind of like little decorative bits down here. Then page four has some headers. So we have to do today and the little things as well as some more title header type ones, some little sticky notes, and these little tiny flag type banners. This color scheme is right up my alley. Then page five is more of like the trackers, little to-do lists and stuff. So we have a water tracker. There's a tracker where you can do whatever you want. There's a couple little weak ones, as well as all these like your kind of universal type planner stickers. Then we have the decorative one, which is kind of just like that fake washi tape type stuff, which obviously is in the same pattern. Then last page is the one where we've got some weekly headers, the numbers for the month, which I loved that. Um, all these little stickers that kind of relate to the theme, as well as our weekly type ones, like meal planning, washing clothes, date nights, payday, that type of thing. So that's everything for the moving pack. Now let's open the Sweet Dreams pack, which will be exactly the same, just different colors, except for that, the first sheet. So for this one, the bonus sticker is a girl laying in bed. And again, different hair colors, different skin tones. Then page one looks like this. So we've got all like dreamy type moon, stars, relaxing type stuff. Like we've got a bubble bath. There's like some tea and stuff. Like, yeah, really enjoy this one. And again, I love the color schemes. I thought I could use these for like a night galaxy type theme. Then we have the same thing in those colors. That one. Oh, that one's actually really pretty. So we got that one. I'll just show you close up. The banners around these have got like stars and stuff and the little banners down the bottom. Then we've got this one, which same again, just different colors. Oh, that's pretty. 
they've got like a floral type one for this decorative and then this one I will show you close up because the items change depending on what theme it is so we've got all these over here which love that now on to the individuals and we actually have a different thank you type card this time which is interesting okay so last time I got a bookish kind of card this time we have this one here which I do love because it's got plants and stuff and like a little reading chair could be and then there's a sticker on the back where she wrote my name in the box and it just says thank you for supporting small businesses so most of the little sticker sheets I'm about to show you are 350 each if they're not if they're more than that I will tell you but assume they're 350 each if not so firstly we have these ones that just say payday I bought enough to do a year so you could choose I think it was silver rose gold gold then I got some rose gold little fuel icons which I thought were just cute I'm not 100% sure if I'm gonna be using them because I do fill up my car like every week because I work out of town so I travel a fair bit with my car so but we'll see then we have the birthday headers sheet so there's space obviously to write people's names or there's just little birthday presents and the words birthday down the bottom then I just got these little ones I liked the colors and I do think I will use these that's called the sticky note set and I got it in soft pastels then we have this mobile Jew one which I thought would be super helpful because I tend to forget about my freaking phone bill everything else is fine because like on the weekly or I actually get a physical bill but I always forget about my phone because the bill comes actually I don't even know if half the time I get the email but it's meant to come electronically and I always forget about the freaking thing so there's enough on here for the 12 months I'll just try and match the colors to my always fully booked planner because if you didn't know the always fully booked planner like each month has a kind of color so I will try and match them but they this one's called mobile bill due then I actually bought four of this one and this is called the budget sticker but what I'm going to do is every week I will put in there how much I've saved in my envelope um, savings challenge. So this way I'll be able to like add it up as I go every week kind of thing. So I bought four sheets so I got enough for every week. And I have a few extras because it doesn't exactly add up for 52. Then I got another metallic -y one and this is just the months and it's in like a cursive font. In case I don't feel like drawing it or something, I can just use this one. And that one is $4.95. It is a little bit bigger and of course it's metallic, but as you can see, it's a bit bigger than their normal sheets. Then we got a freebie. It's actually different than the one I got last time, which is cool. So this is one of the ones that you can get in one of the deluxe kits, but I decided to get this in the... Hobonoki Weeks, whatever that means. Um, this one costs four bucks. This is in the Boss kit. So you can get like a full weekly kit like the other ones I showed you with this kind of design. But I decided to go for just a little one for this one because I don't think I'd use an entire month dedicated to this type of theme, but I could use it throughout. So that's why I went with that. And the colors do match the same as the other two kits I got. Okay, so these must be two freebies because I didn't pay for these. So it says dinners and this week. And it's just two little sheets which might get some use out of. And then I bought a bookmark, which I thought was really freaking cute. And it matches the, uh, I think it's Shh, I'm reading is what it's called pack, which is the other one that I purchased last time that I haven't used yet. But this is the bookmark and it's really freaking cute. And on the back is like this sparkly design, which matches some of the other stuff. And their logo is at the bottom. But yeah, I really like this, I like that it's all pastels. It's really thick, actually. Like, it's quite nice quality. And that one cost $3.50, and it is the Shh, I'm reading one. So it does match the other kit. So in case you're curious, everything that I purchased was $92.70, and I only paid $5.50 shipping. All the stickers are, like, a soft touch. Um, they're not paper, but they're not glossy, so you can write on them and stuff, which obviously for the ones where you write in what your subscription is or how much you've saved or like the star rating ones I got last time where you color in the stars, really helpful. So far I've only used the Crayola Super Tips on them. That's the one I'm currently using for my current month's star ratings in my reading log. I'm sure other pens would work fine because like I said, it's not glossy. It's kind of like soft touch. But yeah, everything is super good quality. Highly recommend them, especially if you're Australian. Shipping is really, really quick and really cheap. So highly recommend checking them out. So that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you in my next one.